Hello, I'm A.D. Ramsey of DaVita Handcraft Soap. Today we're making a black amber lavender soap. I have all my oils melted. I also have my sodium hydroxide and goat milk mix along with some fragrance oil. We'll also have a contrast color and I still have a few of my easy to unmold heavy whipping cream containers. I'll be so sad to see those go. Well, what I'm going to do now is get everything mixed and blended and we'll bring you back when we get ready to do the in the pot swirl. All right, now that we have everything mixed, I will now um, pour a little bit of the contrasting color to make the in the, the pot swirl which I've done once before and it came out so nice I figured I would just do um, something really simple and clean to match the fragrance so I'm going to put a little bit of the base here and once I get that in I'll let it set up and then I'll pour the rest of the soap right on top and give it a couple of swirls so now that I have now that it's set up a little bit, um, we're going to give it a little swirl, and there we go. So now let's pour it inside the container. This should be easy. And I'm doing a voiceover today because it was so loud in the kitchen. I didn't realize how loud um, the television was and I don't know, I guess I just blocked it out. So I figured I would do a annoying voiceover instead. So I really like the color, how the um, black and white turned out. It was really easy, simple to do. And I would definitely try this fragrance again. It was very clean smelling. And I'm only hoping that it doesn't turn too drastic of a color change but we'll see <laughs> once it cures so as I scrape out every little bit of this soap into the container I'll let it set for a moment and try to come up with a design give it a few taps to get all the air out and I will bring you back So this is the end product and we'll wrap it up and see you for the cutting. All right, we're here with the cutting video of the black and white soap with the active charcoal and it's scented with black amber and lavender. So I already took off a few slices and I see I have a couple of drag marks if you look closely. Let's see right down there at the bottom. I didn't mix that properly, so now it has little white drag marks. But that's okay, it won't hurt the soap. It's just aesthetically not right. <laughs> so um, I'll do a couple of more slices. Next time I put the titanium in there, I'll mix it a little better. Uh, let's see how much. Oh, that's a cute little swirl. Swirly, swirly. Hmm. Looking at my stove there. Mm, it smells so good. And I want to say it has a manly scent, but only because I like men, men's cologne. Um, whenever... Oh, I was about to say when my father gets cologne and he doesn't like it, I always um, take it because uh, I love the smell of men's cologne over women's cologne. And we'll do one more slice. He just passed away and I still use his name in the present tense.
There we go. All right. This is A.D. Ramsey of DeVita Handcraft Soap. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And thank you.